So this seems to be a decent enough time to try and conquer one with fractions here. Um, if we're doing the first 15 terms of the series. So again, we're starting with their initial value of 4. Uh, and then we're saying 1 minus the common, uh, common ratio. In this case, is 1 half. Uh, but we're raised to the 15th power. So that's, that's going to be crazy. That's going to be small this time. Over 1 minus the common ratio of 1 half. So this becomes 1 minus. And if I, uh, if I do this, um, 1 minus common ratio of 1 divided by 2 raised to the 15th power. That's a really, really small number. But uh, I'm going to multiply that by 4. So whatever that is times 4. 0.9999694824. Um, divided by 1 half or times 2 basically. So times 4 and then uh, divided by 1 half. So I got 7.99. Nine seven five six or five five eight six. All right, you can see if this is a um, of an infinite. If we kept going, what does it look like? It's approaching. Well, it looks like it's approaching eight. And what happens is that we're going to develop an equation that eventually has this infinite situation uh, to where it's it's getting closer and closer to uh, a big number. Okay. Um, same thing here. If I had a two times. Uh oh, that's okay. <laughs> one minus two to the fifteenth power, all over one minus two. So the one minus two to the fifteenth power is going to be big, as big as the last one was small. Um, two times one minus 2 raised to the 15th power um, and then if you divide that by negative 1 which is 1 minus 2 that gives me 65,534 65,534 so that is the sum of the first 15 terms in that series